Hello and welcome back to Freaky Flyers on the original Xbox. In the last episode, we finished out Andre La Toilette's story, and now we are moving just south of the border of the United States to, yep, you guessed it, to Cactus Rose. So, I'm just going to say a disclaimer for, this, for the remainder of this uh, Let's Play. If you're rooting for Johnny Turbine or Andre La Toilette, I, would, I highly, highly doubt it. I was getting the rust off of myself in those first two playthroughs, and I did discover a few new shortcuts with the uh, speed boost highways in uh, Bigfoot Mountain, so the rest of the racers are going to be taking full advantage of that. So that means that they're gonna, I'm going to have, like, pretty much for La Toilette and Turbine to have a shot, I'm going to have to screw up in the later levels. So something like, something has to go wrong in Grave Danger or Monster Isle for me to for me to, for, for them to have times that would possibly lead to a moving up in the rankings. But without further ado, let's move to our third racer from North America, Cactus Rose. <laughs> and we're gonna go to Bigfoot Mountain, of course, and we're gonna start the game. So let's meet Cactus Rose. Cactus Rose, the toughest tamale in Mexico. A real south of the border superstar. You gotta ride, mister. But after I win this race, I'm going to be south, north, east, west, all over the place. All over your face if you give me trouble. I won't be giving you any trouble at all, ma'am. She's been a Mexican wrestling champion under the name El Diablo Chiquita. And some even say she's a notorious bandito. Did you just say I was a bandito? Who told you that? It's a lie. I came from the rich and give to the poor. You calling that a crime? Yes, but only because I'm rich. Buena suerte, Cactus Rose. I like how she takes a page out of uh, Shadow the Hedgehog's playbook with the uh, motorcycle plane. <laughs> That's a cool idea. Has anybody ever thought of that? But anyway, yes, I did find um, how to unlock more boost highways in some of these levels, so... Um, these times are going to get a lot faster and a lot better as these as this series progresses. But without further ado, let's see Cactus Rose in her first race. So yeah, I'm I'm deathly afraid of shooting down these trees in Bigfoot Mountain because I think somebody got caught underneath that, and so did somebody else. So, jeez. But don't worry, it's. I mean, Bigfoot Mountain, I think you can beat without any of the uh, boost highways, but anyway. Yeah, what you gonna do? And then we're gonna go down here. Hey, Bigfoot. There we go. Get the blue boost highway done. Jeez. I don't really want these rockets. I just kind of want to return Bigfoot to his family, so... Here you go. Oh, shoot. Oh, that's why. Damn it. Don't worry. Just go across. Yeah, that's why I, I, that's why I don't like shooting down the trees, but the shooting down the trees part actually does aid in your time. But I'm so pissed scared of shooting these things down that... Okay, we shot targets down, but... I think I got... Yeah, I think I got unlocked all the boost highways, so... And we've collected the acorns. Now we just have to get Flying Ace. I could have just shot those trees down, I know. This is nada. So yeah, I'm kind of, I'm, I wouldn't say I'm disappointed in myself that I didn't figure that stuff out, but that's kind of, th there is, there's like a bit of a pat on the back moment that you can get when you unlock these boost highways. It's just so fun to look at, but I think I'm in pretty good shape right now with three power-up slots and, oh god, and two health packs? That's incredibly good luck, but too bad I'm pretty much so far ahead, they're not going to do anything to me. I mean...
There we go. Blue boost away. Blast away. <laughs> That actually kind of reminds me, like, our, um, like, our, do, are Mexican stereotypes found to be flattering, or are they, uh, terrible? Like, is Speedy Gonzalez a flattering stereotype of Mexicans? <laughs> I mean, he's a good guy, he's the hero, right? Is that a... Because we're pretty much, yeah... Yeah, we completely lapped everybody, but yeah, sub three minutes, not too shabby, I do say so myself, and way ahead of everybody, but we're going to continue on. We completed five of those missions, no problem, so. Howdy, young lady. Name's Johnny Turbine. Oh, mo. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> hey now. <laughs> Can I be of uh, service? <laughs> you got a wallet? Uh, yeah, sure. No, you don't. You got nada. Golly, you're right. My wallet's been stolen. Thanks, ma'am. Boy, she was swell. I just wish that person hadn't stolen my wallet. I was keeping all my extra gunpowder in it. Ooh, jeez. Okay. What, does he keep it in like a little Ziploc bag like he's a drug dealer? Hey, kid, you want some gunpowder? <laughs> But we're now on the Coyote Canyon, Cactus Rose's hometown in Mexico. I know the instruction manual says she's from Baja, California. So, I mean, she's not like Mexico City. Oh god, I just blew- Did I get the damsel there? I didn't. That was a terrible, terrible thing to happen. Oh my god. Well, this threw me completely off as I failed to get the simple um, damsel in the first part of the level. Jesus Christ. Still sitting in sixth place. And I do know now that the, um, the help the sheriff mission is to shoot the bandits. Oh, God. And that's twice now that I've blown up in this level. This is not a good start, so I'm going to have to scrape my way back. Back into the race. Oh, God. Just, oh, my God. What was that? I am completely thrown off now on my uh, strategy of what I'm supposed to do. Oh, my God. That was a disaster. Oh, three times I've blown up. I guess the gunpowder's getting to her. Jeez. This has not been good luck. Okay, here we go. Toro. Oh, okay, get hit by the bull. I mean, this is all I got left, right? There's nothing. Is the train going to help? Got to try to mount a comeback here. I doubt it will mean anything, though. Ooh, I thought that was heading after me. Jeez. Ow. Oh, God. That's twice now with rockets I've been... I've been gone get... Oh, God. Dodged out of the way of that one. Does the damsel... Well, that was stupid. I'm not going to get any help out of this. Well, I guess it kind of adds to the episode that you're going to see me lose race. It's not that often that that happens, but... <laughs> happens in this one. But don't worry, I think, uh, I think uh, Johnny Turbine... No, I got third with Johnny Turbine. Never mind. I didn't, I didn't lose with him there. 
or I did lose, but I qualified for the next round, so that time had to count. Remember, the time only counts if I, uh, if I qualify for the next round, so... For most of these stages, it has to be a first place time, so... That, I, that, that just kind of makes it competitive a little bit. Jeez. Okay, that was funny. Retry it. Retrying Coyote Canyon with Cactus Rose. So, hopefully this one goes relatively okay. I mean, a bit worrisome, but overall, I think, uh, I mean, she has to do, she has to improve upon that, um, that time of, that time that she got. Okay, that's good. Just don't die. I feel like I'm Bullwinkle. Anyway, here's what it was supposed to look like. <laughs> oh, God. Good shooting. Good shot, Cactus Rose. Good, another one. Blasted him out of the sky. We're still only in fifth place. As I completely... Com that, that, that got Johnny Turbine perfectly. Please? Thank you. I knew I was going to get an ace at some point. <laughs> ace pilot Cactus Rose. <laughs> Still only in second, but that could be changing. Oh god, don't take the green boost highway here. There we go, green. Getting the uh, bandits, I don't know if... That kind of takes a little bit too much. Okay, don't run into the train. Somebody ran into the train last time and they didn't win. Oh my god. Thank god that didn't kill me. Let's go. Boost away. Oh, someone's underneath me. There we go. Great to have those force fields when you're going through the boost highways. A health pack would come in really handy right now. But... Okay, I'll take the force fields. There we go. Please. And there we go. And that's going to be a perfect race. Okay. Wait, did she get an identical time? She did. She got an identical time to what what she got in Bigfoot Mountain. That's that's kind of funny. That's that's kind of hilarious. McBungadoo, okay. That's fine. Let's move on to the next part of the adventure with Cactus Rose. Once it's 
is we're coming to and you can't even trust Bunny anymore. They're gonna pay for this. <laughs> I like how they look like little, what is it, moles? Like, wait, are they supposed to be people? Attention, they look like hairy, like, hairy rats or like hairy roaches. Don't shoot the mariachi band. I know, I learned my lesson from the uh, Andre run. <laughs> I do like the lyrics to this. I've said this already, but uh, it bears repeating. No time to stop at El Baño. <laughs> How fluent are you in Spanish? Me? Not really. Your fort is damaged. I mean, I had to take it in high school. I took it for four years, but... It was kind of like, hey, if you want to go to college, uh, you got to do a foreign language. At least that's what I was told. Oh, God. As I blow up with... No, don't kill my resuppliers. My res... Your board has been Thank you. There's only three forts left. Okay, I got a little bit there. There we go. One more fort, and I'm going to take care of this right now. Please have a little bit of speed on you, Cactus Rose. I, she's a balanced character, so she's a little bit different than Andre and Johnny. As we win that one, no problem. The fort being surrounded, jeez. Not a bad time. Under, under two. But, yeah. We protect the fort from our own bandits. Hopefully they go home and actually clean our living room. But anyway, that will do it for this part. Thank you for watching, and I will see you as we continue Cactus Rose's story. See you then.